Hey, everybody, let's make it pop. And hey, let's learn a little along the way. All right, well, let's make some pop-ups about insects and arthropods. And one of my favorite insects, um, bzz, what do you think it is? It's a bee. And bees are really cool animals, and they're really helpful for, for the environment, for, for our world in general. we got to protect them. Bees are known for their roles in pollination and producing honey. So they have to pollinate all these different flowers, and they, they, they bring the pollen from one flower to another, and, it, and then flowers are able to reproduce. Well, there are a lot of bees in the world. Uh, there's 16,000 different species of bees. Bees are everywhere. They're on every single continent except for Antarctica. So they live everywhere. So um, let's make a pop-up beehive. First, what you're going to need to do is print out the templates. And there's a link down below. You just click on it. You can download it and print it out onto cardstock, any color you'd like. You're going to see two types of lines on these pages, these two pages. There's a solid black line, that's going to be where you cut, and there's a dotted black line, that's going to be where you score. And to score, we're going to do that first. We're going to use a ruler, and we're going to use a really big paper clip. And you're going to just line up the ruler along each one of the dotted lines, and you're going to press down with that paper clip along that dotted line. And the ruler will kind of give you an edge to follow along. So every dotted line that you see on all these pop-up pieces you're going to score, remember using the ruler and using the paper clip and pressing along each one of those dotted lines. All right? So just do it like that. Now, after you've scored all those dotted lines, you're going to use a pair of scissors. You're going to follow along all the solid black lines and cut out all the pieces of this pop-up very carefully. Now you're going to see here, these actually aren't my hands. I am the voice, but the, the hands are, that's Kirsten. She gives me, she gives me two hands to, to make these videos. So thank you, Kirsten. You can see how carefully she cuts out all the pieces. She takes her time, and sometimes she moves the paper to follow her scissors. So it's a little bit easier for her to guide those scissors and cut out the pieces. Now we're going to pre-fold all the pieces. So this main piece folds like that. Now these other pieces fold just like this, one's in the middle, some on the sides. And we're just going to pre-fold all these different pieces, just like that. Fold those inward. This is just going to give our pop-up an idea of which way, which direction it's supposed to fold once it's put together. Fold this bee piece, this is the queen bee right here. I'm going to fold her in half. Then we're going to take this piece and we're going to fold it just right there at that dotted line just like that. Each one of these has three folds on it. Folds just like that. Then we're going to take this piece and we're going to fold it just right there at that dotted line. Folds just like that. Let's get to assembling. We're going to use some regular craft glue. It could just be like Elmer's or any other brand. You can use it. We're going to we're going to glue down this piece. Now see this tab right here and this one right here. They they're actually gray pieces on the um, base page and they should match the shape exactly. So we're going to put some glue on each one of those gray polygons that are right there on the base page. Those they're not really squares, right? They're they're kind of off squares, but anyways, we're going to glue them, and you're going to see that those tabs are exactly the same shape as those gray spaces. So you want to line them up just like this, and make sure the center of this pop-up piece is also aligned with the center of the, the base page. So once you get the tabs in place, you're going to also make sure that the center line of the pop-up is lined up, and you're going to build this pop-up flat. See how that is down the center? Just like that. Press it down. Let it dry because it needs to dry for a second. Let's glue these two side pieces. And you're going to see that, that there are gray areas on the pop-up piece on the right side that match this piece. So we're going to put glue in those gray areas. That's our placement spots. And then we're going to see this, this tab here on this piece lines up perfectly. If you see, see, we can fold it down and then we press it into place. And it should do the same on the base page. Look at that. It fits exactly in place, just like that. Press it down. Make sure it's flat. And let it dry. You could even use the bottom of your glue uh, bottle to press it into place. 
Let's glue this other piece. Now this piece on the left, you're gonna see that there are gray spots. They match on the base page and on the other piece there. And we're just going to, again, put a little glue in that area. Make sure you sort of paint it and spread it inside just that gray area, nowhere else. We don't want your pop-up sticking to itself and not being able to open, right? Now we're gonna line up where that tab goes just like that. And now our pop-up hive is coming together. You can see the, the, the hexagonal sort of hive um, different, different units there, the different cells. Now let's glue this bee here. You can see that the shape of it follows the gray area, so we're just going to paint some glue in. And we're going to put it in place just right there. See how it fits right there? I think that's a little worker bee. And then we got a little drone bee right here. These bees are all helping out. Who? The queen. We gotta leave her for last, right? She's the one making all the new baby bees, right? You know, there are all kinds of websites online that you can check out to learn more about all these different insects, all these different arthropods. You can always look in books too. That's what us old people used to do when, when we were young. We didn't have the internet. So we would look in books. I know, it's pretty amazing, right? Now this piece here, this is the last piece. This is the queen of our, our little beehive that we're building. And we're gonna make sure that she's lined up. See that shape? It fits exactly the top of her body. So we'll put some glue on the gray areas on this tab here. See these triangular sort of tab things? They, they fit the shape of our queen bee. And then we'll fit her right on top, just like this. And we'll make sure that she is centered, just like that. See, she positions just like that. Make sure that she's centered and press her down. Make sure that your, your piece dries and you press it into place. And now, let's see if it works. Let's close it shut. Look at that. Oh my gosh, it's our very own beehive. Look at, and there's the, there's the queen bee. She's like, hey everybody, do what I tell you to do. Look at that, oh man. You better get making some honey. That's what she's saying. Look at that. So that is our pop-up beehive with three different types of bees. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this learning unit, insects and arthropods. Um, be sure to hit like and subscribe if you like this um, video. And um, there will be more um, that we'll be to learn about and make pop-ups for. All right. See you next time.